Okay, anyway, I love Kirky, but let's face it, the guy's a five. Staying in that's just a dirty pool. He's at least a six. A six? All right, you go ahead and pump rainbows into his asshole, but I'm just being honest. Come on, cut him some slack. Look, half a point, because he's a nice guy, right? And he's funny, so that's half a point each. That brings him to six. That was right. But he drives a shitbox, so you have to deduct a point, take a point off. Wait, what's wrong with my neon? Oh, I don't know, except the people that make that car don't even like it. So we're back to a five. Five. <clears throat> Meanwhile, this Molly is a hard ten. And that five-point disparity, that is a chasm. Chasm? Chasm. And you can't jump more than two points. Where do you get this shit? Trust me, Kirk, I can't even get a ten. <laughs> Well, not even you, huh? I'm a six, okay? Bullshit, you're a six, and what am I? You're an eight. Okay, fine, you're a six then. But I get a one-point bump, because I'm in a band. Stanner, you're in a Holland Oates cover band. I, I, I'm pretty sure that's a deduction. Adult education is a tribute band. So that puts me back at a seven. On a good day, the best I can bag is a nine. Well, what about your crappy car? Artist exemption. I'm expected to have a shitty car. Is there an artist exemption for talking out your ass? Yeah, it's called being a rock star, Jack. Look it up in the dictionary. It's there, next to fuck you. Guys, I think this system's ridiculous, all right? If someone really loves you, then you are a 10. My god, what, are you Hannah Montana? Because nothing you're saying right now is of any help to Kirk. <laughs>